In very cold areas, condensing batteries for electric vehicles do work normally in the frigid winter temperatures of minus 45 degrees Celsius. Lithium batteries are susceptible to low temperatures, and lithium fuel full batteries are even more sensitive to them, especially during charging at temperatures below freezing. During charging, lithium ions move from the positive electrode to the negative electrode and are embedded inside the battery. The lower the temperature, the slower the chemical reaction inside the battery, resulting in a rapid increase in chemical resistance, which greatly affects the embedding of lithium ions. This can cause lithium to precipitate at the negative electrode damaging the internal structure of the battery and causing it to swell. Therefore, we need to design a heating system for batteries. When the temperature is low, the charger should be responsible for heating the batteries. The regular circuit between the lithium battery and the charger is as follows. Lithium battery, BMS and the charger. And based on this, we need to design a heating system. For example, when the battery temperature drops below zero degrees, the charger and discharge functions of the BMS are disconnected and the switch of the heating module controlled by BMS is turned on. This will cause the charger to supply power to the heating film to start heating. When the temperature reaches the set 5 degrees, the system will switch to charging the lithium battery. And is it difficult to implement the heating system described above? Here is the solution. You need a smart BMS. First, the BMS NTC temperature control probe can detect the battery's temperature in real time. Second, it has a programming mode that can turn our ideas into calculation logic. Third, we can output signal to control the heating mode externally. According to George's law, the heating film is a thin film material that can generate heat when current flows through it. The power of the heating film must match to the power of the charger, otherwise it will not be able to start. For example, for 48 volts 2 ampere charger, a heating film with a resistance of around 25 ohms and a power of 100 watts should be selected. The heating motor, in short, is a low voltage switch that is controlled by the BMS to heat the heating film. And that's the heating principle of a lithium battery's BMS. Do you get it? Okay guys, everything I've been helpful, likes and subs appreciate it. See you next time. Bye.